Welcome to Hughes Handbill. Let's talk Sportsters. They're hot. Everybody knows it. I'm into them. You're into them. And what's hot right now is that you can build them any way you want. One of the products we've come up with is a lowering and lift kit for the rear of your solid mount Sportster. This should work on 8803 models. We'll verify that somewhere else and make sure in the description of the video and in our product model listing that it fits right. But essentially what you're looking at is uh, we've got these CNC machine pieces that are made here in the United States and we literally bolt this right onto your factory swing arm. If you have a half circle shaped shock tab on the rear of your swing arm, you can install this with just two bolts, hardware is included, and two three quarter inch wrenches or a socket and a wrench and you're ready to rock. So what does that do for you? You're going to put one on each side of your swing arm. This particular swing arm we've just bolted one on for show. Let's talk about attitude. Your factory bike will have the shock mounted in the middle mount on this. And if you want to retain that middle mount, shouldn't be an issue. Just use your stock hardware, bolt it on there, no problem. But say you want to go for the tracker look or you're looking for um, like the hooligan bikes that are racing now and some of the cool stuff that folks are doing, give that bike a little more lift. Move your shock to the forward location. And again, you're using your factory hardware or the hardware supplied with your aftermarket shocks. That'll give you about an inch of lift if you use the forward location on your swing arm mount. Move your shock to the rear. Same thing, just the opposite direction. Now you're lowering it about an inch. This gives you plus or minus an inch of, of clearance, attitude, style on your bike without changing your expensive shocks. A lot of folks have invested money in nice shocks, but maybe they really wish they had 14 inch shocks, but they've got a 13 or, uh, you know, trends come and go. So you're thinking about, do I want to lower my bike? Do I want to lift my bike? This is an affordable solution and it gives you options without having to really dedicate to a four or five hundred dollar pair of shocks. Um, should be a great product, should dig it. Check it out, make sure to look at us on Instagram, Hughes Handbuilt. Same thing for Facebook, Hughes Handbuilt. We've also got stuff on our website, tech articles, stuff like that, so it's www.hugheshandbuilt.com. Hit us up in the comments section. Uh, concerns, questions, we'd be happy to help you out. Take care.